he was um, just out totally. And I thought, well, he lost consciousness, obviously. So I, I just started shaking him, slapping him, dialed 999. The call came in and Tina answered the phone and she was um, very panicky and she said that her husband had collapsed and wasn't breathing. So I instructed them to do um, CPR and um, between them they managed to do it while I helped them doing the counting to keep in time. Within literally minutes we had police, we had motorbike, paramedics, ambulance. When we took him to but his heart was beating, but he was still unconscious, so we had no idea what the outcome of that situation was going to be. Having a chance much further down the line to say, wow, you're here, you're alive, it is very emotional and it reminds you why you come to work and do the job. It's a beautiful thing. The whole experience has been quite overwhelming actually meeting the family and uh, I promise I wouldn't cry but I did but um, yeah it was it was lovely it was really nice well I must yeah I must be very lucky to uh, to survive but if he wasn't of the uh, of the ambulance team probably I wouldn't be here now talking to you was, yeah very happy I'd like to thank everyone personally yeah.